Bitch Boy Troy just dropped a new YouTube video called She Broke Up With Me, where he talks to his baby mama, Yanni. In the video, Yanni looks upset and says that she broke up with him because he recently linked up with Brooklyn Queen. Everybody say you a stalker. You're because a is no is reaching because she said, I live here. She was talking about LA in general. Is reaching so bad because we was in front of some apartments, right? So is reaching so bad they think that I, I they, she was talking about the apartments we was in front of. Mm. Whole time she talking about I live here. She talking about in LA in general. And they say you was breaking your neck, smiling and. Bro, that was literally awkward smile. This. Y'all This is were, an awkward smile. If you see my, if you, both were cheap. I have my glasses on. If you see my eyes. You could have seen my whole face. It was an awkward smile. Like, that, that sh was not no, like, this, it wasn't on no shit like this. this. This time. Like, I'm serious this time. How? And I ain't do sh Like, you did do sh I ain't do nothing. You bro. did do shit. So, I really don't wanna, and I really don't wanna. Like, it's like an. I really don't wanna. Big guy, I bro. really don't wanna talk about everything you do do. But anyway, that's not the point. Uh, long story short, we're done. A lot of people weren't feeling Troy after that. They were saying things like, he should just stay home, focus on being a family with Yanni, especially since they've got a baby on the way. People were mad, saying it's wild because sure, he can't control who he runs into, but he can control who he's giving his time and attention to. Right after all that, Brooklyn Queen threw some shade at Yanni by posting this TikTok video, following her run-in with Troy. People in the comments were quick to say it might be shade because if you saw Troy's video, she was wearing the same outfit. But anyway, let me know what you guys think about this and everything else down in the comment section below. Now I do want to speak on this next topic with KB. Recently, as Nadia's hairstylist claimed that Kayla gave KB gonorrhea in his mouth. Nadia later addressed the situation, saying that KB had a conversation with her and a few others about it. However, KB denied the whole thing, saying he never talked to them about that and even showed his mouth to clear up the rumors. I don't play about my health, period. I don't play about my health, you feel me? On the live, she said me, her, and another female had a conversation. I've never had a conversation like that with Nadia. I promise. Never. Just off that alone. I don't know who's saying or who's saying what. But they need to stop saying it because I've never had no conversation with Nadia about nothing like that. And I can merge on everything. Be saying y'all trolling me. Y'all be trying to out troll me talking about my mouth and I, I ain't nothing going on in, in these. Ain't nothing going on in this premises right here. I can't show y'all my Johnson, but I can assure y'all it's nothing going on nowhere. You feel me? Now, I want to move on to the next topic with Asia because it looks like she went live to respond to Wooda and Chicago Hottie after Chicago Hottie claimed that Wooda set her up. When I said I did not want to hop up on this internet and do this, but since people want to talk about me for, for what? If you had to say your side of the story, that was cool, but why was you trying to talk? Oh, I don't know why Asia was trying to come like she was trying to spare you. Da -da 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 -da. She don't live out here. You're right. I don't live in Philadelphia. I live outside of Philadelphia. So what was you trying to say with that? Number one. Number two, if I didn't have something to do that day, I absolutely was going to touch that girl. And I and I had my reasons why. You brought that girl out here and you hopped on the phone with Didi. I don't know what was said between you and Didi, but along the lines, Didi found out that she was coming out here because of you. It was your video shoot. It was nobody else's video shoot. It was yours. So what is you trying to come up on this internet? Oh, I don't even know why. But I, I didn't mention I didn't mention your name not one time. I never said Wuda told me nothing. I never said that. For messy margin, I'm the post that that had nothing to do with me. Even if you listen to it, I never once said your name. Never. So don't ever come up on this internet trying to play me. Look, right, if Mir didn't shoot the video, right, how would Mir know where y'all is at? No, Mir knew that she was landing at that time. Because I was on. I didn't know what time she was landing? What the fuck? I'm saying. But she basically saying other motherfuckers knew she was coming to the city. That's all we're trying to say. Now let me know what you guys think about this and everything else down in the comment section below.